Hi there, in today's video I'm gonna show you how you can easily remove any background from your images using Microsoft PowerPoint and I'll show you how you can save the image with a transparent background so you can use it in any of your other projects. But before we begin make sure you subscribe to the channel and give this video a thumbs up and without wasting any more time let's jump straight into PowerPoint. First of all we need to create a new blank presentation. To do that, select the Blank Presentation option in the Theme section and click Create. Or you can simply head over to the File menu and select New Presentation from there. We need to remove these default text boxes. Now we are ready to bring in the image we want to remove the background from. Make sure you are on the Home tab. Now click on the picture tool and select the picture from the file option that will open up the file browser. Select your image and click insert that will place your image onto the slide. Now we are ready to remove the background. Make sure you have your image selected and in the picture format tab click on the remove background button. What PowerPoint will try to do is to automatically identify the background and the foreground of the photo. The area that is covered with this magenta color will be removed. And that is not quite what we want here. As you can see, there are parts of the image that we want to keep and there are parts that belong to the background that should be removed. So what we can do is to use these tools up here to mark the area we want to keep and the area we want to remove. Let me select the mark areas to keep tool first. The mouse pointer will turn into a pencil and now I can just draw over areas I want to keep. It will also look for any similar areas to keep those as well. It's looking pretty good. Now let's select the mark areas to remove tool and draw over areas we want to remove. And let's tidy this up a little bit more. Once you're happy with the selected areas, click on the Apply Changes button or you can just click anywhere on the slide outside the image and that will apply the changes. As you can see, the background has been removed from the image. Now, if we zoom into the image, we can see that the edges are somewhat harsh and it's not looking too good and we can fix this very easily. Select the image that will activate the Picture Format tab again Navigate to the Artistic Effects tool, then click on the Artistic Effects option. This will bring up the Format Picture panel on the right-hand side. Then we need to expand the Soft Edges tab. And in here you'll see this size slider. Let's set it to 1.5 points. This value can be different for your image, just play with it until you like the result. Alright, we're almost done. One more thing that you might want to do is to crop your image to remove this unnecessary transparent area. Select the image and in the picture format tab, click on the crop tool. This will activate the crop frame around the image. Now simply drag the sides and once you're happy with the result, click anywhere on the slide outside the image to apply the changes. Let's see what it would look like if we place this image on some background. Let me quickly create a new slide and insert a new image as a background. Now I'll copy our image with the transparent background and insert it into that slide. Is looking good. Alright, so one more thing that I would like to show you is how you can save your image and preserve the transparency so you can use it outside of PowerPoint. Make sure you select the image by clicking on it once. 
then right click it and select save as picture option. This will bring up the file explorer. Now choose where you want to save this picture. I'll save mine on the desktop. And in the save as type setting, select PNG. This format will allow you to keep that transparency. Now click save. And let's have a quick look at the saved picture. As you can see, it has a transparent background now. Alright, I hope this video was helpful. Please give it a like and check out my other videos on PowerPoint. And don't forget to subscribe. I'll see you in the next one. Bye!